Personal Brain allows you to visualize the information you're creating in many different formats. Today we're going to be taking a closer look at what we call Outline View. Let's get started. The default view in Personal Brain is what we call Normal View. You're visualizing the active thought in the very center and one generation away from the active thought in all directions. Parent thoughts, siblings, child thoughts down below, and jump thoughts over to the side. But I'd like to take a look at the bigger picture, more thoughts on the screen at one time. And one option for doing that is going into Outline View. There are many different ways Outline View could be accessed. You can right click the background, go down to Views and select Outline View. You can also click on View at the top of the application, or simply click on the Switch View button. I'll select Outline View. You'll notice that I'm still visualizing the active thought and one generation away from the active thought. To expand an additional generation, I can simply click on the Expand All button at the top of the application. This gives me immediate results. I now have two generations of parents, and one of my thoughts, Network Map, has a whole series of child thoughts which is being visualized on the screen right now as well. Clicking Expand All again, produces an additional generation away from the current active thought, IT. Now I can see on screen three generations of children down into Network Maps, the children of Network Maps, and their children on the screen as well. I've expanded so many thoughts, I've run out of real estate. For this reason, I may need to make some changes to the application. I'm going to go full screen with Personal Brain and double click on the background behind the thoughts. The thoughts have now taken over the entire application window, but I still would like to do some adjustments. You'll notice that I can move the thoughts around by simply clicking and dragging on the background. I've centered the active thought, and now I'll use the resizing circle to make the font size of the thoughts a little bit smaller. Perfect. I'm seeing all the thoughts I'd like to visualize on the screen at the same time. Remember, you can click up and down on the resizing circle, the small circle that encompasses the active thought. I can also hover over the active thought and use my mouse wheel to increase or decrease font size. In addition to the Expand All button, there's also a Collapse All button as well. Obviously, the Collapse All button simply removes one generation of thoughts away from the active thought. While you're in Expanded View, you'll notice that individual thoughts have their own Expand and Collapse buttons. If I hover over Applications, I can see an Expand button located right above the thought. Now I can select individual thoughts and their relationships that I'd like to display on the screen. I'll open up my CRM apps, as well as my user communities. And how about my finance apps? If I've made a mistake or I decide not to visualize content, simply use the individual collapse button. As you can see, Outline View is a fantastic option for really getting a high-level overview of how all the information you're inputting into your personal brain is starting to fit together. It's a wonderful tool for meetings, presentations, or even just brainstorming about the current state of your data. And remember, the Plex is still functioning the same as it would if you were in Normal View. If I think of an additional category under Applications, I'll simply click and drag to create a new child thought. The new thought has been created and I can continue to add content or even link this particular thought 
to distant locations that I wouldn't typically be able to visualize in normal view. For instance, if I expand servers by location, I not only have all of my London servers linked to this particular thought, but also people that are working out of the London office. One of them happens to be Bill Tampkin. I'm simply going to draw a link from Bill down to the thought for London. And now I can clearly see that those two previously distant thoughts are now connected and associated with one another. And remember, you always have the option at any time to switch back to the normal view. I encourage you to take a look at your own personal brain in outline view. You may be surprised at the relationships that exist within your very own data. Enjoy using personal brain.